Hey guys, episode four of Ask Michael. And today we got a pretty nice question by Gabriel Both, and he is asking how to know the search volume for a YouTube keyword before you target it. Thanks for the question, Gabriel, and we get this started right away. Alright, before I answer this question, I'm just gonna say um, you don't really need to do this. You know, you don't really need to actually find out the search volume for a specific keyword for uh, YouTube ranking, you know? I mean, a lot of people actually ask me this, like how do I do this and that. And I think it's just a result of overthinking things. I mean, with Google, it makes sense when you do highly uh, complicated search engine optimization and stuff like this. But for YouTube, for the most part, it is mostly the case that you're actually uploading a video about a specific topic that you have made uh, because you actually wanted to create this video, right? So there's not too many uh, different keywords that you can search for uh, anyways. And the way I do it, I can show you this real quick actually. Um, the way I do it is the following way. And it's pretty simple actually, nothing too complicated. Um, if I want to make videos, let, let's say it's about uh, how to uh, make money online. All I do is I type in this keyword, and actually I did too much already. Let's say I have a video about making money online or something like this. So I simply go for how to make money and then it already suggests me specific keywords right and I see the third one right here is how to make money online so I click here and then in your case uh, you want to know the search volume you can see that this one has around uh, 21 million uh, search results but this doesn't really bring you anything right now right so you're a result and maybe it actually scares you right because you actually typed in this keyword right now and now you're scared now you go like oh my god this has 21 uh, million results I will never rank for this right so what you're gonna do right now is you simply ignore this number and you rank for this anyways right um, so you can simply outrank all these other videos right here by using the strategies that I teach and that are really simple actually. So I actually wouldn't worry, worry about uh, the, the actual uh, search results or search volume or something like this too much. I would simply do my keyword research the way I teach you to do it. And that's simply by actually using this search box right here. And you also have to understand that YouTube doesn't have like the keywords planner anymore like we have on Google. Um, so that's also one thing that um, we cannot use anymore. But on YouTube, it really, it's just simply all about these suggestions, like what the, the YouTube search is telling you. Um, that basically shows you what people are searching for and these are the keywords uh, to go for. And please never think uh, that you cannot rank for a specific keyword just because it seems too competitive or the, the videos on the first page have, have too many views or something like this. This is never an excuse for not trying to rank a video high for a specific uh, search term. And um, yeah, I hope this helped you and um, be sure to like the video and subscribe to my channel and see you soon.